So, YouTube says I'm live, I'm back online. Hi guys, this is ADC. Welcome back to my channel. I've been missing for some days. I, I skipped the live stream uh, on Friday and I'm, I'm very, very sorry for that. Sorry guys, but this, this month has been, has been crazy for me. Um, my work uh, took the most part of my uh, days, so I wasn't able to, to stream as much as I wanted. But today we are back talking about Jubei. So Jubei is the new release of this Monday, Akotoba, very interesting indeed. Let's go buy him and wait for someone to join us. So, am I live? I think so, but is anyone here with us? I don't think so. I'm alone, alone on the internet, talking to myself through a webcam. That's interesting. Ha, modern days technology. Keep, you be, please. Ooh, so for the seal, yeah, that, that's an interesting one. So I will wait for someone to arrive and then I will, will talk about the seal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so... <laughs> Jubei. Hmm. Interesting mix between a heavy and a multi-hitter here. Also shock. That's a... That's a, an interesting and new combination, I think. I don't remember any... Any guys, any... Kotobas, at least, with this kind of skill set. Hi, Malteser. Notifications OP. What does it mean? Notifications OP. I don't know. Just elaborate in the, in the chat so I can understand what you mean. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So... Well, Jubei is, of course, a Kotoba, a Marauder, and a Wemelite. Hmm, that's interesting. So he synergizes as well with Ariana also. Hmm, that could be interesting. Later we will try. So, as for the seal goes... Oh, let me wait. I don't want to talk to myself. Okay, two are watching. I don't know, maybe someone else will join us. Anyway. As for the seal goes, at first glance, oh, I get a pop-up when you go live, so I only miss like a minute. Oh, great, 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 Malteser. I'm glad you have a notification when I go live. So, as for the seal goes, at first glance, Jubei screams for strength seal. He has this uh, multipli multiplicator here, red and yellow, hit four times strength. So, uh, for each activation of this skill, he will get, with the strength seal, six by five, 240 output. So, uh, if, you, if you count on activating two times this skill on average, then you will have 480 output uh, with it. So, 480. But, if you use the damage seal, then uh, you will get with uh, three yellows, uh, sorry, three reds and one yellow, he will hit four times, uh, sorry, he will hit ten times, so you will have 500 with the damage seal. So, at first glance, Jubei wants the strength seal, but you need to pay attention since the best seal for him is going to be the damage seal. This third skill, three times hit 100 and damage plus, plus 20, is perfect. Perfect with the with the damage seal, and also this uh, multiplicator here for strength will synergize well with the damage seal also. So, uh, on average, it will hit ten or eleven times, and that's very very good. Uh, so you will have at least five hundred output by for the damage seal. So. Also, with the damage seal, the damage seal will, of course, suffer from um, spellbreaker, of course, but there are no, not so many spellbreakers out there. But also, 
uh, it will it will um, it will overcome the backstab. So it will Jubei can go full multi hitter or shocker. That's an interesting trait of it of him. So let's go for the damage seal. Here we go. So I was playing with <laughs> subs. So let's go with Kotobas. Oh, I have another Kotoba I I um, I wasn't able to review, and that's Iro. And I think Iro is a great card, so I will play with this uh, this one too. So another combination between Strength Multiplier and Shocks, just like Jubei, but this time Hero has not only a Spellbreaker four times Strength, that's very very good with Strength, but also this first skill Shield two times Strength, and that's why Hero needs the Strength seal. There's no doubt about that. So Hero is this one. So let's go with a standard Strength team by Kotobas. Here is she. Where is our friend Mastema? Mastema is here. Oh, I sealed Mastema with um, Stench. And that's an interesting combination. I think uh, Mastema, of course, is stronger with damage or even more with Strength Seal. But the reason I uh, put um, put um, Stench on him is that uh, most of the time you will use Mastema as uh, a suicidal buffer. Let's be honest. So you will not you will not try to win with Masama most of the time. But with Stench Seal, it can be an interesting counter to every every uh, strength user out there. So he has a lot of activations, so he can be pretty effective with Stench. That's an interesting choice. And for the fifth member of our team, let's use we need another strength user. Owekagi is always good. Also, Soeko is good, but Ogwekage is one of my favorite cards of all time, so let's go and let's roll with it. Okay, choose my hero. So we have Jubei right from the get-go. But, hmm, let me see. Backstab, Shock. Okay, Izomo has a great deal of shocks, so Ogwekage is not the best one. So I will start with Jubei himself. I think he can be strong, even against Azajiro this time. Also, Jubei is a pure attacker with this first skill, this Shock 900. It's a very good... Oh, I have Ice here. And that's because I have um, Pain on my hand. So I need Ice. Sorry, guys. Okay, Shock. I will play with Ice on my, <laughs> on my hand. Uh, 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 so... I have that kind of um, pain you have when you use, ooh, perfect shock, when you use uh, too much your hand uh, with computers and smartphones. So I have the, I don't know how to call it, but uh, a lot of pain in my hand. I use the computer for work also, and I play a lot, so it happens. So as you can see, with this roll, we dealt 2700 unmodifiable shock right from the get go, so that's crazy. Jubei is indeed strong. So, sorry for the ice, guys. Maybe, no, my mouse is, uh, <laughs> is for the right hand, so I cannot use it with the left one. Okay, Torrent the Regent. He's very good. Rage user. Let's go with Ido. Ido is good against rage users. Of course, Ido synergizes well with humans, and I forgot about that. So maybe. Okay, but I have a perfect roll, so that's what I wanted. Oh. Yeah. Look at that. Look at how much shield. He can put on himself. No one is gonna touch Hero. Very good. Great. Great, great, great. Now choose my hero and I will go with Mastema. Oh. 
So, backstab user, so I will go full buff. Hi, hi, man, hi, Singo. Ooh, perfect suicidal buffer, that's great. Ah, okay. This hand is killing me. If any of you guys know how to deal with pain in your hand for too much use of the mouse and keyboard, let me know. Okay, Thomas Jr., we won. And now we have a crazy powerful Chi and a crazy powerful Oguekage also. So, dodge. Hmm. You know. I will go with she here, I don't care. He's so powerful, I don't think he may can do anything if I have a good roll. I don't have one though, but okay, at least a decent one. Oh. Mm -hmm. You need to master me. <laughs> That's great. That's great. I will do it, man. If that's for the sake of my health, I will do it. <laughs> uh, that's great. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. We won big time. So, let's try again with this team. It's a good one. So, hero 3, 1, 2, 3, 5, 1, 2. With a mixed team, not so good, at least at first glance. Brayer, mm, shield user, Rosen. Well, I will go with she brute force here. Let's go with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow, that's a good, good roll. Not a perfect one. He does have a perfect roll. Great amount of shield. Brewer was interesting when he first came out. I was fairly impressed by him. Hmm. It's called repetitive strangery. Yeah, there are many articles you can look at. The few small thing is how you position your hand. Make sure they don't carry the whole weight of your arm. Okay, I will do it and I will search for it. Thank you very much. Um, so, hmm, I will go with Mastema here. There are many articles, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I would go full suicidal. Most of the time, Mastema use, is used as a suicidal buffer, in my experience. That's probably the best way to use him. Now, for some reason, you think Jubei is worth buying. I want to play Kotoba missing Colossi. Do you think I can use him or Mazamune instead? Well, um, I think Jubei is definitely interesting and worth buying. Yeah, he definitely is. Um, I don't think Kotoba right now are the best guild to play, uh, at least to, uh, do, to rank up high. Um, but I think you can... Uh, do you think I can use him or Mazamune instead? I think um, the teams where Jubei is really, really strong are not the uh, same teams uh, in when where Ime and Mazamune uh, go. So, sorry, I will yeah I will go with Ogokage here since the other two are heavy hitters and so no need to use Terror uh, later. So, um, as I was saying, um, I think I definitely think uh, he is worth buying, but if you want to use um, heavy Kotobas with Hime and Mazamune, then Jubei is not the, the, the guy for you. Jubei is for um, strength user Kotobas or um, shockers or, or um, plus damage, not for, uh, not for criticals and heavy hitting, I think. So... So if you want to play heavy Kotoba, 
then Yubei is not for you. But if you want to play Kotobas in general or Strength Kotoba, then Yubei is perfect. Yubei is perfect. And I think is best thing about him is his versatility. Is not Yubei is not um, a technical card. Uh, it, it's not a card with a lot of counter mechanics. Uh, but it is a very, very versatile card, I think. So, shocks, multi-hits, heavy hits, is a mixture of those. So, maybe you can use Jubei also with Hime if you wanna... Yeah, no, maybe, you know, maybe I, I was wrong. Maybe Jubei can be synergic with Hime. Yeah, because the first one is a shock. Eh? Yeah, maybe I was too too categoric here. No, you can use it. Yeah. Okay, I will play. I will. I will try that. I will try. Um. I will try in a in a team with with a heavy 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 Mazamune here. Why not? Yeah, I I forgot about the thing that. Mm, Jubei is more versatile than I than I originally thought. And that's because this hit here will synergize well even with him. So Jubei actually is synergic with all his guild. That's very good. So it's a very easy it's a trump card. I think it's definitely worth playing if you want to play Kotobas. Yeah, that's very good. So I will play. Of course it is not synergic with Akisa, but that's that's okay. But it's synergic both with Ime and Master Masu. Yeah, that's great. So let's go for heavy Kotobas. Where is another heavy guys? Yeah, you know, maybe Hero. Yeah, Hero is fine. Even though Yubei is not a human, maybe. Uh, yeah, Kimiko. Kimiko is fine. Let's go. This is a heavy Kotoba team, and as you can see, Jubei fits right into it. So, okay, let's go with Ime here. I want to lure Sightweer, and that's great. Do you remember, guys, when Sightweer was the undisputed king of the entire game? I remember it. It was crazy, dominating all the arena. Sightweer, great duke. And Ogmore. Those were the three cards you, you needed to have if you wanted to, to do uh, high rank in Master League. Those were crazy days. The game was very, very diff different and worse, <laughs> in my opinion. Armada. So I want pure output against Armada, and Jubei is right there for us. Let's go avoid blues. And let's go full multi-hit. Very good. So as you can see, this way he's gonna hit 16 times. That's crazy. Oh, Armada has a perfect roll. Hmm. I'm writing down repetitive strain injury. <laughs> as, as soon as I will close this stream. I will go search for it since I have a lot of pain. Okay, look at that! 3500! We beat it, Armada! That's silver for you. I'm trying him in a double support multi hitter team. You beat Chichi's Mrs. Le oh, I will try that. Yeah, 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 definitely. Okay, now we have. Hmm. I, I think Kimiko can do good here. Eyes, okay. Okay. Oh, maybe we have. Okay. I'm trying him. So Jubei, Chichis, Chichis is always good. Mrs. Slayer, Slayer is always with Bloodsword and Milad. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> I, I. First game versus a Berserk team. Okay, that's great. Anyway, I think. Uh, Jubei can be interesting in a multi-hitting team, but also, you know, I think successful uh, multi-hitting teams are the ones that do not rely um, on just pure output uh, cards, but also with counter mechanics. So, 
I don't know, Easy Yield. Mm. Against Easy Yield, I think, yeah, I will go with Mazamuna here. Should be good enough. With a good roll, we should be able to win. Okay, that's perfect, guys. Mm -hmm. He has a perfect rule, but I, I don't know. I don't think Easy Yield can win against Mazamuna. Mazamuna is one of the best if not the best heavy hitter in the entire game. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe with against Powder, but no, no. Look at that, almost 6,000. Mazamuna is massive. Guys, okay, we won. Let's try another one. So as you can see, this Jubei, I really like it. Um, I'm, not the, uh, I'm not a big fan of cards with pure output and without counter mechanics. So I really like cards that are very technical, that are um, that have specific matchups and so on, and Jubei is not really that kind of card. But this time I have to say, um, Jubei is a much more interesting card um, when you look deep into it. I think, yeah, since he's so, I don't know, so versatile, so synergic with everything you have in this guild, it might be just the perfect card. Oh, I have a perfect roll, but yeah, come on, let's search for the blue. Okay, no. Um, it might be perfect for this guild. He is, yeah, solid, reliable, very good. Okay, now here I was I was talking and I did a mistake. I should have um, rolled again, searching for the blue. Now. We lost, and that's on me, with a blue, of course, or the perfect roll I would have won, but okay, this game starts bad, let's go with she. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. MK52. Master Mage Mars in. I don't think can deal with our she. Okay. Good, good roll. He has a, a good roll too. Our fireball is strong enough. I think we'll see. One and two. That's great. Yep. Hi, Noodle. <laughs> Hi, man. So, ooh, body chair. I f I wasn't able to test her. She looks good though. This smite here is very interesting. So, Kunok against mages is very strong, but that fireball is interesting. Yeah. I don't want to use Jubei here. I will go with Mazamune. Then Kimiko is very strong against Body Chair. Very strong. So we need another sword or a blue. Okay, that's perfect. Friendly battle, Nuke Town. It's fine by me. If you want to play against me, just. Um, Ask me in the in the app, so send me a request, and if the game will allow me, I will play against you every time. Mazamune, great. And now, okay, I know we are here to test Yube, but the good move here is definitely to use Kimiko. Kimiko is perfect in this spot. Is crazy strong against Body Chair, and also. Very strong against Brayer, so oh yeah, man. I, I don't know. I don't think that's a good good choice. The best one was to play in Brayer, I guess. But anyway, he's counting on his shield bash. Yeah, maybe he is right, but I don't know. 
Yeah, it's strong, but not strong enough, I guess. Yep. He didn't have any chance. Okay, I think that straight is better on you. Strength is better. Double rib? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Man potato, follow me, um, because that's, that's very important. If you trigger uh, uh, two times this, the second skill, the, the, the yellow, okay, you will have, as you, you were saying, 480 um, damage from the strength seal. But if you trigger at least three times the red one, that's very, very easy to do, with um, the yellows also. So if, you, if you're trying, for example, the, 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 double, um, the double rainbow here, you will hit eight times. Eight times uh, multiplied by uh, 50 is 400, so it's less. But if you trigger at least three times red, then your damage seal will, will be um, higher than the strength seal. So I think uh, the, the strength seal is better only in very, very specific roles, um, especially two roles. The free red, uh, sorry, well, maybe just for the double rainbow, since even in the, I don't know, free reds and free yellows will be free to 12, 12, 450 is 600, and four, 12. Okay, no, just for two roles is better the strength seal the double rainbow and the um, and the uh, free red and free yellows then uh, the um, the strength seal is better but for all the other roles the damage seal is better so I think uh, so I think uh, overall the damage seal is much more versatile and it will be uh, much more strong most of the time, especially if you use Jubei without Colossi, but even if you play it uh, with Colossi, you will not be able to pull the free reds and free yellow rolls most of the time, and also the perfect uh, double rainbow also is very difficult, but the ultra double rainbow or the full red or the full red and one yellow are very, very easy to pull out, so I think the, even though the strength skill has uh, a lot of value, I think the damage seal is much more strong overall. So we won, I added you, says Nuke, so let's try to, uh -huh. to accept him. Where is the friend's request here? Oh, <laughs> I have a lot of them. Malteser here, I will accept it all. Oh, the game is... Okay, I've accepted all of you guys, so... Let's wait for him in, in the meantime. Mm, got it. So now, I want to try Jubei. Jubei in... Oh, Z, I forgot about that earlier. So, I want to test him with other multi-hitters, so I will try him with Bloodsword. Let's go. And we need other... Okay, so... Other multi-hitters, Kotobas... Oh, you have been challenging? Okay. Uh, oh, as you can see, there's the bug. I cannot accept you, I'm sorry for that. Um... Now, what's the best course of action here? Chichis, that's for sure. Torment is great, but I don't know. Hmm. So, Chichis, I want interesting synergies, cards like. Yeah, Kiridan maybe is wasted in a team that this. in this kind of teams. Hmm, let me see. Huh. That's crazy. It's difficult to choose. Hmm. Mystic Slayer is very good. So, oh, as you can see, there's a bug. I cannot accept you, I'm sorry. I tried, but... No way, sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know how and why. 
uh, but that's the way it is. Okay, I will go with Ash. Uh, so no, not Eliamfra, Ash. Ash is always interesting as a multi-hitter with crazy synergies. Okay, so now we're trying Jubei without Colossi in a Marauder team. Waiting. Oh, great! Tempus team! Oh, with the Jailer? The Jailer with Strength Seal? Mm, I don't know. I don't think it's the best best thing here. So the Eternal. The Eternal is crazy strong. Guys, I think we can't win against the Eternal. Hmm. I want to spare Master Mystic Slayer for later. Hmm. That's tough. So I will go with Chichis here and try to trigger just reds. It's gonna be tough, probably I'm gonna lose, but okay. That's the only move I can think of, but probably is gonna end bad thanks to the thorns. At least we will not allow him to trigger Deja Vu. But um, yeah, the Eternal is very, very strong. Okay, maybe, maybe we have a chance. Chichis is another very versatile hero, one of the best multi-hitters in the game. Yeah, and he won, thanks to this crazy, crazy roll. So, okay, I know very, very well this kind of team, this uh, Tempus team, since I've played it a lot. And I don't think this is the best way to use it. Also, the announcer with shield, I don't know. I don't think it's the best. I think the announcer is best with Resilience or Thorn. Probably Thorn is even better. Slightly better. I don't know. Okay, now. I will go with Ash. Okay. If he throws me uh, the announcer, then we will probably lose. But it's fine. It's fine. Since if we activate this first skill, he will copy it, but mm, I don't know. So, yeah, the announcer will kick the our will kick our asses. Maybe the best pick would have been Master Mystic Slayer. Oh I don't know. Okay, the jailer. This is a mistake. This is a big mistake for him. If I manage to avoid oh and I will uh, a sword then it's bad. I will keep this unperfect <laughs> uh, roll just to avoid rolling a sword and this way we have a chance I think. If we roll a sword we are doomed this way I think we can do it. Of course it will trigger portal but too little and too late. Or maybe he will be able to win. I don't know. Let's see. Nope. I was calculating correctly. I know these matchups. Lord Tempus is dangerous. He is a mage, though, and a Master Mystic Slayer. Hmm. Even though Lord Tempus can copy our powerful shocks, so it's not the best. Course of action. I will go with Master Mystic Slayer here against Dolorean and try to roll two blues. Yeah. Okay. Oh, maybe. Yeah! That's great, guys. <laughs> 3600 shock. Sorry, Dolorean. Just wait for it. One and two. Goodbye, Dolorean. It was nice. Bam! That's very good. 3 all perfect. We wanted to test uh, Jubei with Bloodsword. We did, <laughs> we did not, but we won, so who cares? Let's fight again. So that was not the best way to play Tempus, guys. Ooh, Centaurium is a friend of mine. EAI, Italian player. Hey man, with an interesting runic legion team. Hmm. So Sevilat will punish our Ash, so we cannot use it. But you know, we will use Master Mystic Slayer. 
Sorry, guys. So, hmm. I wanted another yellow, but ooh, perfect! Uh, a mega blessing count. But I think we can we can win with a lot of multi hits. So he will not activate his noble shield. That's fine. His shock and smite. It's not a big deal for us, so easy one, easy win, sorry, Master Mystic Slayer is always very, 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 very strong and versatile. Now, choose my hero. Hm. I think Corantia and Lania will kick our asses, so I need to pump Chichis and Ash with my Blood Sword. Okay, that's good. He threw Lania in the mix. Soraya was more dangerous since... Okay, we will try full buff. Okay, this way is good. Perfect roll by Lania. But now, Chichis and Ash are <laughs> crazy strong. Ash is truly one card, one hell of a card. I really like it. So, very versatile. And now we have our Jubei. Hmm. Body chair is good. Now, Jubei can be pretty strong against Soraya, I guess. So, yeah, because we have tiny hits. So, that's very good. Another red. Oh, perfect. Whoa. With this one, strength would have been <laughs> much more useful, but... Still, I think we're gonna be fine. Yeah, he will scarab our first two hits, but we don't care. Easy one. Easy win today. I have this thing. Easy one. I don't know why. Anyway, sorry, Soraya. And now, haha. <laughs> Okay, we, we have an advantage, but it's not easy to win here, since Ash is very weak against Body Chair. Even though we are good against... And also Corantia has Runic Shock, so let me see. Hmm. Let's go with Chichis. Chichis is not particularly strong against any of these two, but he is strong with everything, so. Good roll, not perfect, but I think good enough. He will activate Rune Shock two times, and that will be strong against us, but he will also hit. Oh. Okay, let me see. Okay. Yeah, with his swords. Chichis is so freaking strong, guys. Chichis now, I think, is one of the strongest cards in the entire game. Probably the best multi-hitter of all time. He is crazy. Man, I, I can... He, he always won. He, he won... For me, at least, he won all the games I, <laughs> I use it, so... Okay, now we try a different multi-hitting style. This way, this time with Milad. And that's, as you guys know, is the best way, at least for me, to play multi-hitters with Milad. So, let me see. Okay, MC Electro is one of the best multi-hitters of the game, so we want to play it. Where is MC, our old friend? And also, so, let's check all the multi-hitters in this game. Of course we're gonna play Jubei here, but... Okay, here. Mm-hmm. Those are good, but not perfect. Okay, okay. Those. Okay. Ash is very useful, of course. Carry also is good. GG is perfect. And... But I think, you know, I'm in love with this guy, Valkyrian, I think he is very versatile, so 
Let's play with this thing. Master Mystic is another good candidate for this kind of teams. Ooh. Ice Knight, ZK, let's go with the Milad. Maybe Valkyrian, yeah, yeah. Valkyrian is one of the best. Um, Valkyrian is the perfect multi hitter in my opinion. I think multi hitters need to be like this one, like Chichis and Valkyrian. So, multi hitters, but with counter mechanics. And now we have MC Electro, that's an interesting bard with combinations and so on, dice triggers and something like that. Valkyrian is good against heavy hitters, Chichis against uh, multi hitters. So, that's why. I play this kind of cards. Okay, double buff. That's good. That's why uh, I think Jubei is not is not perfect for this kind of teams because I think uh, this kind of teams needs heroes like Valkyrian and Chichis with counter mechanics. Uh, uh, Jubei is perfect, I think, for um, Kotova teams. I think Jubei is perfect also for new players since he blends in every team with strength, with, mm, I don't know, um, criticals, with plus damage. He's just a trump card, just throw in in, in the mix and he will always, always work. Now, I will go with Jubei here. You will see how strong, as a multi-hitter, he can be. Yeah. Now, 11 hits is gonna be tough. Tough for this Captain Halkiri Q with 100 Thunderstruck. I'm sorry, she has a good a good role, but she's not gonna make it. No way. Look at that. Crazy synergy, and now nine hits. Yeah, as you can see, it's just too much. So he's very effective, uh, don't get me wrong, I think Jubei is very very strong. I just think he's best in other teams. Uh, Milad teams needs more specific counter heroes, in my opinion. These three heroes are perfect for uh, Milad teams. Those are three of the best, if not the best. And the fourth one, I don't know, but anyway. Let me see. I wanna keep Valkyrian for... Uh, yeah, I will go with Chichis. He will come at me with Armada thinking, yeah, I don't suffer thorns, but I will destroy him <laughs> using multi-hits, maybe, if I have a good roll, of course. The best course of action here is to use Armada against me. That's for sure. Yeah, that's it. Ooh, that's a good start. Oh, maybe we... Oh, man. Great. Chichis is so strong, guys. If you don't have Chichis, you need to buy him. I don't know. You want to play multi-hit? He is your guys. You want to play knee hunt? He is your guys. So... Ah, what are we talking about? He is so strong. Sorry, Armada. I don't think you can deal with our powerful friend. 4,000! Come on! And now... Against Milad. Oh, Sushi. So... What's the best here? Hmm. I will use Valkyrian. Maybe we're gonna lose. I don't know. Okay, that's a good roll. Six dodges, come on! Six dodges and 1,800 shocks, that's good. These cards, no, I'm a big fan of them, so they behave good when I play them. Okay, look at that, that's a great, great output, almost 3,000 with 6 dodges. Guys, this is crazy. Valkyrie is a great card. Ah, today I love cards so much. <laughs> Jubei won. Okay, so as you can see, Jubei is very effective. He's a straightforward guy, easy to play, blends in everywhere. He's a true, true 
Swift Knife, maybe not, uh, I usually say Swift Knife when I talk about cards like um, Chichis, for example, or even more Taraxa that have multiple counter mechanics. But he he's good in probably every freaking team you can think of. Oh, Master Mage is probably the, the fifth member of this team. I forgot about him. He's just <laughs> so strong. Okay, so the best... Uh, if you, I, I've played this team a lot, but I think this team right here is the best multi-hitter team you can uh, you can play. Okay, that's a great team. If you want to try it, try it. But we was talking about Kotobas today, so I will play again a Kotoba team. This time a different one. Okay. Yubei. Oh, maybe we want to play a, a for fun team with all the crows. So Kurokage is almost a, a crow. Karazu Kage is definitely a crow. So, let me see. Is it a crow? A crow? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> I want to play a crow team. Can I win with a crow team? I don't know. The fifth one would, would be <laughs> Nakiza, but... Oh. Also dive in the crowd. Mm, that's good. I I don't have <laughs> a seal on Karazukage. Karazukage is, I've, in my opinion, the best artwork in the game, probably. He's not so strong, though. I will use the shield seal on him. And on Daijin, life brain equals strength. Six, four, no. I will go with four on him. Ganzo. Ganzo is a crow? Is it? Oh. I don't know. It's. No, it resembles a crow, but. Guys, I said I wanted to play a crow team, so I will play a fucking crow team. Even though it <laughs> it's not synergic with anything, I will play the Kiza. And I will try to win for you guys with this crazy team with no synergies at all, with the Kiza throwing in the mix just because it's good looking. That's how real players win with RNG, crazy teams with no synergies at all. So let's go with the Kurokage here and use our dodges to dodge Hero the champion. Let's go. Come on, give me a good, a good roll. No, <laughs> this team is so bad. I almost cannot believe it. Is I think that's the worst team I've ever played <laughs> in a ranked game. I think that's <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Spanier, maybe <laughs> he is a crowd deep down in his heart. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, sacrifice the Kiza. Okay, maybe we can win against Furagu. Guys, concentrate, please. Okay, we'll keep the swords. Uh, I, no, I don't know. Uh, old shield. Uh, look. Uh, no! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Teyura with dodge is not bad at all. Okay, guys, that was bad and sad and uh, depressing, and so, um, yeah. <laughs> Daishin. The crowd team. <laughs> I, at least I tried. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Quick, quick uh, note. Guys, do not play with teams just because you like the cards in it. <laughs> okay. 
That's bad. <laughs> okay, in this kind of team, not even Jubei can do good. So let's resume a serious one. Okay, now I want to play another strength base team before we we used Hero. But this time we will not use him. Oh, okay. That's good. Okay, this is a good one. This is a good team. Oh, there's a bug. Okay, she is turning red. I don't know. The announcer. Hmm. Jubei. Hi, Bruno and Rihanna. Okay, that's an easy win for Ogwe Kage, but I don't want to sacrifice Ogwe Kage right from the get go. I think I will go with she here. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's that's good. That's a good roll. Ooh, rage. So he, he's a rager. I don't know why. I don't think I thought about the hybrid and Rihanna, but I don't think uh, Jubei can synergize well with Hybrid and Rihanna since yeah he he will multi-hit but later if the two um, if the two uh, skills were swapped first the the multi-hit and then the four times hit then he would be great with Rage but this time no and even Masuma has a, a, a problem. Later we will try, the next team we will try a Gwemelite team with Jubei. Okay, so let me see. The announcer. The announcer has... Hmm. No, I will go suicidal buff here, if possible. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. I prefer to use him this way. It's too dangerous this um, matchup against the announcer, so I prefer to 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 win. To sorry, to to buff and make Ogwe and Jubei freaking strong. Now Ogwe can destroy Minzashi and also Jubei. So. He will be our attacker. Oh, Zia also. Everyone has... Oh, and Valkyrian here. No, I don't think this team can work. Now, against Valkyrian... Hmm. Let me see. Yeah, I will go with Overkage and win. Collect an easy win. Yeah. Oh, perfect. And then attack with Jubei. And just destroy. Perfect role for him, but our our um, terror is too high to deal with. Yeah. Look at that, one thousand, crazy. He could have won only with the three times free reds and free blue roll. Let's go with Jubei and win this one. I know that in a suicidal type matchup, Stench Rune is better for Master, but, but you, don't you think that it's a bit weak compared to the other runes? Yeah, I think so. And also, isn't damage the best for this general matchups? No. Okay, okay, I will reply to you in a, in a minute. So, let me. Oh, I want at least a yellow though. Okay, yes. Oh, perfect, perfect, oh, look, look at this one. We will win so much. Ninzashi is gonna, his, his head is gonna spin, look at that. Come on, what are we talking about? Crazy. Okay, um, so, no, uh, no, I don't think the damage seal is the best overall for Mastermind. I think if you wanna play Mastermind to win, then you need to play, um, play it with um, strength or 
even better, probably uh, resilience or force. Uh, so I think um, damage is not good since he will not eat so many times. I think the damage seal is only good when cards hits uh, at least nine times now. Mastermind that does not do that, so I think uh, other um, uh, seals like strength, like shield, like resilience, like form are better for him. I decided to use stench since I basically use Masuma always as a, as a societal buffer, so I don't care to um, for uh, winning with him. But I do care if I encounter, I know, a pirate or a Kotoba team, then Masuma can be my trump card. I will se send him to just um, get a good roll with two yellows and one blue, maybe, or I don't know, and use Stench to win win that single matchup. So Masuma can be either a speci specific counter with Stench uh, and a suicidal buffer. I prefer to use him this way. That's... Um, I, I know it's an obvious choice, but I don't care about winning with Massimo. I really don't. So, so the last team of this day, it's a Gwemelite team. Let me see. Oh, no, no, no training. I don't, I don't care for training. So, no, 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 not only Kotobas, all the Gwemelites, please. So, we will use, as for a buffer, we will use our friend Ariana. Archmage on Rihanna. Okay, now on Rihanna. Oh, why this bug? Oh, come on, this bug is bad. Let me refresh. I'm sorry, but I will refresh the browser now. Yeah, I want to. Okay, maybe this time it will work. Okay, oh, it's in Italian. Oof, come on. English? Yeah. Okay, so we was we were talking about Gremlites. Okay. Okay. So as I was saying, I want Arena, but I think Arena now is better with resilience. So I will change her oh that's the game is unusually uh, slow so that's that's bad I don't know what it is anyway let's play with her and then multi hits so let me see mm, those are not so good mm. yeah again this is best Ooh, Octavia is good Octavia is a good one but I'm C Electro. You can't play without him. Hmm. Yeah, okay. The last one is gonna be Octavia. That's very good. I have an assignment to finish by midnight, so I'm going to leave now. Bye bye, good luck with Water Fix Your Pains, man. Thank you, Malteser. Have a nice day and uh, also night. And also, uh, good luck for your assignment. We will fight the last game of, to, of today with Gwemelites. Let's go. So choose my hero. Why not starting with Jubei? He is great. He is a good attacker. So let's go. Double shock is coming, and I like it. Ooh, maybe triple shock is coming. Nope. Still, good roll. Oh, perfect roll for Thunder King. This game, why it's so so slow? Ah, that's bad. Let's hope it does not crash. Okay. I'm curious about this. Oh. Man, it's working so bad. Okay, we won. That's fair. Waiting for our enemy. Johan. So, 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 so. Valkyrian is gonna be good. 
Also, MC would have been good, but okay. Hmm, bad wall for us. Oh, not great wall for him too, but um, he's probably gonna win this one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's bad. Hmm. Mm -hmm. At least he will not trigger a brave, but yeah, we lost, of course, as expected. Archmage, let's go. I don't think Archmage can win, but I think, okay, he he will use Great Duke. That's a, a good move, since Great Duke will be useless against these bards. Just a single buff, it will be enough, I think. Those are unsealed, so I think we will easily win. With, with decent rolls, of course. Without decent rolls, we will always lose. And that's that can happen with a team without Colossi, so... Okay. Purify and Noble Shock. That's good. Noble Smite. And that's fine. Hmm. Okay, now we need to win, but I think... Okay... Huh, now it's interesting, since... Hmm... hmm. hmm. I will go with Octavia here. Oh! I have a perfect roll, so okay, we'll see. We should be able to win. Yeah, he wanted to go for four reds, one blue and one yellow, and that would, would have been great for him, for him to trigger two times the brave shock. But anyway, we will win big time here. Now with MC Electro. Mid output here. Perfect. Good roll, not perfect, but should be enough. It should be enough. <laughs> Lightning. That's good. Okay, we should be able to avoid the brave part, so we, we should be fine, almost 3,500 almost, so yeah, no way we won, so great cards again. So guys, Jube is a great card, uh, it's uh, playing him when I first saw him, I thought, yeah, well, a pure output card without uh, interesting synergies nor anything, so I was, meh. But now that I have played him, I think he's good. Very good for new players, that indeed. Great for Kotoba players. He is, um, he is basically versatile, simple to use, straightforward, and, I don't know, it synergizes well with everything. With Arena, with Melad, with Bloodsword, with Mastema, with Hime, with other strength buffs um, like Ikarasti, maybe, or something. So I think for new players, he is perfect. And for Cortoba players, he will be the fifth member of a lot of teams. So he's a great card. Do not underestimate him. He has a great out output. He is very versatile and also he's very dangerous uh, in attack with this powerful shock. So very, very good. Um, Kotobas needed um, a multi-hitter like that. So I'm very happy with him. Um, I think you should sh definitely check him, check it out, check it, check, check him out. And uh, as for today, we will close the stream and we will see each other on Friday. This time I will try my best to not miss the uh, 
the stream with you. I, I really care about this stream, so I'm sorry if I missed a couple of them, but I will try my best to be here on Friday at 12, probably. So uh, keep an eye on my channel, click on the subscribe button, and we will see each other as soon as possible on Friday. Bye, guys.